previous video, we learned how to make a table of values. This video will show how to take those table of values and make a graph. Here is the first table of values that we made together. Notice that it has the X values and the Y values. When we write our coordinates, it's always X comma Y with brackets around it. So these coordinates are equal to 0 on the X, 6 on the Y, 7 on the X, 13 on the Y, 3 on the X, 9 on the Y. This one is a value of 9 on the X axis and 15 on the Y axis. And then lastly, we have 4 and 10. Let's plot these onto our grid. We will now plot these points on our grid. The first point, 0 and 6, remember our x tells us whether we go to the left or to the right, and our y tells us whether we go up or whether we go down. Let's plot this point. We start at the origin, and notice that it's 0, so we don't move to the left or to the right. Then we look at our y value and we need to move up 6. So our point is right there. Our next coordinate point will be 7, 13. So again, starting at the 0, 0, so this spot right here, we move over 7 to the right and up 13 to put our spot right there. Our next point is going to be 3, 9. So again, starting at our origin, we move to the right 3 and up 9. So our point is right there. Our next point on the X, we move over 9 and then up 15. So our point is right there. And our last point for this table of values will be 4, 10. So again, starting at the point of origin, move to the right 4 and then up 10. Looking closely at this line, we notice that it does indeed form a straight line. So this is what we would call a linear equation. Let's do our last example. Here is our table of values from before. Again, this is what our coordinate points would look like. Remembering it's always x comma y, and then we have our brackets. Now let's plot these coordinate points. So our first point will be 6, 3. So again, this is my origin. I move to the right 6 and then up 3. My next point is going to be 7, 4. So starting at the origin to the right 7 and then up 4. My next point will be 5, 2, so to the right, 5 spots, and then up 2. My next coordinate point will be 8, 5, so again, at my origin is where I start looking, to the right, 8, and then up 5. And my last point will be 1, so move over 1 and negative 2. And that point, we move over 1 to the right, but then negative 2 means we need to move down 2. So that point is right here. Again, examining our graph closely, we'll notice that if we put these dots in a line, they will form a straight line. So again, this would be what we call a linear equation.